Hi, this is Brad, SharpensVest.com. You know me. Out goofing off again. We're going to call this our rifle knife. It's got a little flashlight on it. Um, it's a spring uh, assist knife. It's got a clip on the other side for your pocket. Kind of a cool looking little knife. We'll pinch it here, hang on to it. Kind of built like a rifle. All right, like that. Come around on this side, you got your lock and your opener. The lock is the one that slides up and down here. And nope, back here. So that slide that up like that. I'm gonna turn around here just a little bit. So if you wanna if you wanna close it, okay, that's locked. If it's up, down, push the button, lock it back up there. Now, even if you push the button, it won't open up. Put it down like this. Oop. <laughs> That's where the blame ding me. It's actually got a... <laughs> what a tar. <laughs> okay. <laughs> oh, my God. I shouldn't have eaten that ice cream. <laughs> All right. We'll get it up in the air here. It's really, got, it's really got quite a spring. It's a pretty cool knife in a lot of ways. So you can actually shut it like this. Okay, then you move your lock up. So even if you happen to push the button, it won't unlock. All right, it won't open up. And there's really a pretty good spring on it. And it's uh, actually, it's tight. Uh, it doesn't just wobble inside the uh, hinge mechanism, okay? And we're gonna sell these on our website and um, I believe this is probably going to be about $17.95, something like that. It's got a really good little light on it here. You fold the light up like that, and you turn it, and how do you like that? And I'll tell you what, I'll bet you at night that's a pretty good little light, because she sure is bright uh, in the daytime. So we fold that back down, and we'll close it up. We open it one more time, like that. All right, let's check it on some paper and see what we got here. We seem to always find the wind. That's okay. We just work with it. Clean up the mess in here. And uh, let's see. Okay, that's really... That's not not real good. So let's work on it a little bit. Get it turned here where I can go to work. Just like this. Match the bevel on the blade. Turn it about 30 degrees, 40, 45, whatever you can get out of it. You know, just like that. Come right on out to the tip. It's a little bit of a thick grind on the blade. So just like this, right on out, up that way. Just don't press too hard because it will cut that blade. There's no question there. All right, let's see. If that's close. Well, it's sure sharper than it was. Actually, that's pretty close. Uh, if you really want a knife sharp, spend about three, four, five minutes just brushing on it like I did. And um, don't push too hard on it. Let it work. Don't make it work. Unless you got a horribly dull blade, then you're going to have to push on it a little bit, you know. Um, again, here some people say, well, I don't understand quite what you're doing. There's a flat face right there on each side of that face is a 90 degree corner. 90 degree corner right there. 90 degree corner right there. You touch that 90 degree corner to the blade like this, match the bevel 12, 14 degrees. Turn the knife a little bit and begin to brush the sharpener out or come back this way or out that way. I'm going to set it down and work on it like this. It's really actually kind of thick, so you'd have to flatten this. You'd have to flatten the bevel out a little bit on this knife to really make it a slicer. If you want to keep it a little bit more of a work knife, then maybe you want to leave it the way it is. A uh, little bit thicker blade, tougher blade, not as sharp. So you work on it like this. If I just sat around for, I don't know, perhaps five, six minutes with it tipped down, more like a, a eight, ten degree bevel, I would actually cut the side of that knife down. And it really wouldn't take very long to do it either. Just like that. So we're going to quit here in a minute. Let's see if I made a noticeable change in the short time more that I worked on it. And I can see little teeny tiny uh, silvery dust. I can see it on the side of the knife. I can see it on the black on the table there. Uh, so I know I'm cutting the blade. Sometimes you actually have to reshape the blade. You just got to cut it down. And yeah, you might do it with a whetstone, but can you imagine having to completely reshape a blade with a whetstone? 
you'd be there for, I don't even know, two or three hours maybe. Uh, but that's sharper than it was already. Sharpensbest.com rifle knife. It's got a flashlight on it. It's got a lock. It's got the open. It's a spring assist. All right, so let's pinch it right about <laughs> there. All right, fold it up. Lock it. And there it is, rifle knife. Sharpensbest.com, $17.95. Got a clip, spring assist. It's a good little knife. This is Brad. You take care. Have a good day.